Today's first reading from, is taken from the book of Job. And it invites us and challenges us to re-examine our relationship with God, you know, especially in moments of adversity and suffering. Now, we heard the scene. This was the heavenly scene. God appears before Satan and accuses Job of self-serving faith. So God allows Satan to take everything from Job except his life. What is noteworthy here is Job's reaction. He, he mourns, but he does not curse God. Instead, he acknowledges God's sovereignty and trusts in God's goodness, and this despite the suffering. You know, we, we heard how much everything, or how everything was taken from Job. It was just one disaster after another. And yet again, his remarkable reaction was mourning, but never cursing God. The author tells us, in all this, Job did not sin, nor did he say anything disrespectful to God. He only trusted in God's goodness. Dear brothers and sisters, true devotion is tested in adversity. And faith is not avoiding suffering, but trusting God in the face of sufferings, knowing that His ways are not our ways. And so, a good question for us to ask ourselves today is, how do we respond in unexpected trials and adversities of life? Do we trust in His goodness? Let us pray for the grace you know, to see His hands intertwined. I mentioned the other day, His hands, His plans intertwined in our lives, knowing that in all the circumstances, whatever circumstances, whatever circumstance in life, whether good or not so good, God is indeed with us and never abandons us.